So this is what happens when you use really old paints and they're too thick and you decide to do like one of those deconstructed bloom deals. Yeah, but the paints are also too thick. The pillow looked too thick. I used jewel tones because I thought they'd be pretty. Um, but this one, you know, okay, it's fine. It's a terrible disaster, but this is the real, oh my God. Last minute on this bloom where I used the thing. Um, last minute I put gold on there and I ruined it. So, oh yeah, I'm gonna stop it now. So yeah, this is uh, what you call a disaster. <laughs> I'm trying to find some good spots and if you go close and we have no lighting, didn't help by the way, did not help to have no lighting. But even as I spun this thing out for dear life, I, I took all the good stuff with it because I thought if we opened up some of these cells, we might get layers of color underneath because I did the traditional one round ball over another, you know, just little round layers and then blew it out. But even as I you know, spun it out, it didn't improve. The mistake was adding the gold um, cell activator at the end because it was so runny and everything else is so thick. And it just kind of muddied everything. But, you know, every painting has its areas of bliss. Uh, actually, this is my favorite part, just all the transparents doing their natural stuff. No bling. No nonsense, nothing. There are some cells and I, you know, I could have done it better if I just stuck with the Payne's gray and the white. We probably would have had a decent little bloom here, but the good news is it's on a five by seven canvas. The bad news is I'm at a pouring medium. I can't really stretch my paints anymore. They're kind of really runny and over glossed. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna seal them up and we'll add them after we you know, filter them and everything to a new pouring medium and more paint and get a much nicer thing. If they're not total gloop by then, because some of them have just had too much gloss added to them and might be time to just accept that that one ounce of paint has been stretched enough. Anyway, these are my two paintings. I said I'd stay three minutes. This is just three minutes. Uh, Talk to you tomorrow, Mom, like I texted. Athena's made some leftover steak for me, and I'm going to go sit with her, and i got to clean this up. But yeah, we have to get this whole thing in order, because until I get this thing in order, I don't think I can make a decent painting. Okay, over and out. Bye-bye. One last look at this. <laughs> Amazing bunch of colors doing all kinds of kooky things with their friends look at that they're all just hanging out this is like your paint on new year's day this is, what they, this is your brain this is your brain on pouring medium okay i'm done bye bye